My name is Sterling Smitty from InspectionSoftware.com. I'd like to show you our new software rewritten for the iPad called Identify and Report version 12. What I'd like to show you is we are not connected to the internet in any way, shape, or form. What that means is this is a standalone program on the iPad. We are actually trying to get the iPad to think it's a computer. So, you can move the files back and forth from the iPad to your PC or Mac with no problems at all. Here, let's go over and we're going to find an inspection. We have a sample inspection right here. I'll pick that one. This is the order form itself. As you can see, it's very detailed. You can even do things like we have an agent organizer and you can come over to the agent organizer. You can select, and this would be a list of all the agents. And you could populate the order form automatically. This is a database environment, so all you have to do is put things in one time and it applies across the entire system. You can even look up the address with Google Maps. It's actually Google MLS. We'll go to the current inspection. We'll go to foundation. Here at the top of the screen, you can say completed. And if you see along the side here, all the buttons will change according to what you selected over here on the top. So, we'll go over to slab comments. Select the comments from the database. This is a description of the comments here. We'll select the exact comment that we want. Copy it right to the report. We can even say see photo number if we like. See photo number six. Copy it to the report. You notice we typed nothing. Now let's go over to photo number six. That would be one, two, three, four, five, six. This one right here. Let's take a photo. Of course, you can use your finger if you want. I'm going to try to do this with a little bit of coordination. Oh, there's a photo. Not bad lighting, since there is none. <laughs> we'll use it. There's the photo right there. That's all you need to do. Photo is in. You can put a comment below the photo if you want. There's actually a database of comments right underneath the photo that if you could pop it right in. You don't even have to type it. That's all there is to it. You can print the report from here. You can email it if you want. Let's go over and look at some of the other sections. Exterior. These are what we call identifiers, where you're identifying what you're looking at. Surface grade. We'll go over here, and the surface grade is... It works better with your finger, I guess. Come on, surface grade. There we go. Surface grade is... Oh, is... Generally flat. How's that? So we just built that little comment, right? Like that. Didn't type a thing. Of course, we have all our other sections. Roof and attic. Chimney. Interior. Interior is nice because we talk about rooms individually. So if we're talking about the living room, I'll say living room. So now all the comments... Oh, here, let's go to the next clean sentence. Let's clear this up. Tap it one time and delete it. Boom. Now we'll go back to... Let's go to interior and we'll say... Let's get rid of all this here stuff. Oops. Delete. And let's go... Press enter a couple of times, get down to the line so I can show you. I'll go dining room. And see the word dining room goes right into the report. Now we'll say dining room windows. And we have a problem with the windows. We can select it. Windows need adjusted. Copy it to the report. That's it. See, we just built that sentence. We even have recommendations. A recommendation number two. We'll put that into the report. Copy it right to the report. Works better with your finger. Come on. But there's the actual comment itself. This is, like I said, a brief overview. If you'd like further information, please contact us at inspectionsoftware.com. My name is Sterling Smitty. I would like to answer all your questions if possible. And you can just see how much time you'll save by using the iPad. Remember, if you use the iPad, 
you're going to get like 95% of your inspection on the iPad at the time of the inspection. So when you come back, you're only going to spend 15 or 20 minutes putting this report together and you can send it out. I used to spend up to an hour, hour and a half, sometimes two hours to actually do my report after I got back in the office. Now there's no need for that at all. I just plug in the iPad, bring it up, proofread it, and send it. That's all there is to it. Like I said, my name is Sterling Smitty. I'm at inspectionsoftware.com. Contact me and I'll give you all the information you need. Good day.